please be quiet in there? Oh, sorry, I didn't know you were here. Hello, it is September 6th, and I'm just playing prank with your today forecast. For Hollywood, Tennessee, we have lesser, well, it's cur we currently have a thunderstorm outside. As you can see, it's very blurry. The reason why this is blurry is because we've got heavy shower downpours. Downpours. I was outside in this downpours, and my hair is really wet, so... Um, yeah, it's, it's really raining outside. It is 73 degrees, you means uh, 94%, and the wind is actually not calm. It's going around... Well, now it's calm, but early it was going 6 miles per hour, so we had a heavy storm, but this passed. I would like to show you the remains of this storm. Um, let me pull that up. There we go. This is the remains of that storm that we had. This is Holland World, right through that green marker. But, yeah, this just scattered heavy showers all over the place. Look at all of this. If you can turn off the hand dial. Okay, um, so you could see, you could see Columbia. Columbia is about to get portions of the storm. And, yeah, I mean, this, it split up a little bit. Columbia's a little lucky, because they've got this little shield around them. But... Uh, yeah, this part of the storm is very heavy. This part is just slightly uh, away from Nashville. But we've got Portland, White, Wild Home. We got the White House over here. And those parts are going to be under a very heavy Pacific rain. And Lawrenceburg just earlier just got hit by a line. Where is this Lawrenceburg? I'm trying to find Holland World. There we go. Hohenwald, Lawrenceburg got hit by a line that, which is, Lawrenceburg is right here. This was the line they got hit by, and it was pretty heavy, but this storm did not last for long. This is what we're going to be looking at. Yeah, this is what we're going to be looking at. Look at this heavy storm. You can see some of those pink right there, showing how heavy this storm is. Now, I mean... Hole in the Malls and Tennessee's got the really heavy storms, but let's go to Chicago. Chicago's got the longest storms, actually. We do have a small twisted line right by Park City, you know, Park City, Wakan, uh, Bar or Beach Park, and Wadsworth, I think, uh, I think it's how you say it. Lake Buck. We had this giant storm that moved through. And we do have, well, we did have a special marine warning that was over here in this area. This was the storm we were looking at in Lafayette, Lafayette, I think that's how you say it. I don't, I'm not uh, used to pronouncing these kinds of words. Please crop that out, didn't mean to say that. Um, and we also did have a big storm here earlier. This was the storm that moved through Michigan, so we are going to be looking at very heavy storms. But... Hawaii is clear. We do not have to monitor this. Still very heavy lines for Hohenwald. And longer lasting storms for Chicago. Maybe a small round or two for over here. But this is probably not going to impact uh, Chicago very much. Yeah, this storm has just left. A little bit of those remains of the storm is right here. And that's leaving. So... This big, these two storms, this is actually a full line, and all these storms are, <laughs> oh, I thought you were, okay. This is actually a full line, all of these storms are getting broken apart, but still very strong. I think our storm for the day is going to be forming A over here, B over here, so, <clears throat> we could have a big line, this is, we're going to see a big line form here, then past Tennessee, around, two uh, or longer then by seven this sweet should come down then move toward north carolina areas then break down so let's go back to our forecast and that is the storms we, we've been seeing so yeah let's look at chicago it is you can see those lights on you can see that showers pouring down that this is our storm that we had just a few minutes ago it is 68 degrees, humidity 74 percent, and the wind is going south at five or seven miles per hour. There we go. Our camera is live, and 
Yeah, it's very, very sh uh, stormy, actually. We did have a warning issued here earlier, so, uh, but that expired. So we do have that 30% chance, sh ch uh, chance of showers. Then tomorrow, that chance of showers remains 30%. Then by Friday, we will uh, cool back down to dry conditions again. So... <clears throat> And it's going to be staying very dry this week for uh, portions of Hawaii, or portions of Hawaii, uh, Chicago, and Hohen Walls. For Hawaii, it is currently fair. You can see <clears throat> outside, it's not very rainy or stormy. It's just nighttime, so we do not have to be concerned about anything for Hawaii. It's 71 degrees, you can 88%, and the wind is going northwest at 3 miles per hour. And we do have that 20% chance of showers re remaining all through the next three days. So, we could be seeing a, some scattered showers around uh, Hawaii now. For your three-day forecast, I am your just in training, Joseph Lamprey. Oh, there's a black screen.